Hi guys, welcome to Office Bloke's Reacts. I'm Office Bloke Dave. I'm Office Bloke Mike. I'm the chairman. You are the chairman. <laughs> <laughs> so, we are the Office Blokes. We've got a Patreon page. We have indeed. Yeah, we've had loads of people supporting us on Patreon as well, which has been absolutely massively... Uh, Massively great and appreciated. Uh, so if you fancy joining the other people doing it, go on off at patreon.com, put in Office Blokes React. Uh, yeah, come check it out. It's cheap. Lois always say it's cheap. Yeah, it is cheap, really cheap. cheap. And we cheap, got cheap, to put cheap. Malice on the Palace on there yet. Malice at the Palace. <laughs> no, I'll do it tonight. Yeah. yeah. I, I found it. Because it's a lot of people. It's on the old backups. Backups. Yeah, a lot of people so, uh, were asking for it. <clears throat> yeah, but I'll sort it. So, for £1.50. Uh, oh, yeah. Is our lowest patrons here. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, yeah, and we've got a couple of other channels as well, haven't we? we have. Yeah, we've got Office Blokes Try, where we try stuff, where we've done beatboxing, Dave's done the one-chip challenge, Bravely. Yeah, that was brilliant. And things like that. that. Yeah, and we've got uh, Office Bloke Podcast, where every Friday, 6pm, <laughs> British Standard Time, three of us talk shit, and a new segment, which has just come out, which is Mike and myself, yeah. talking shit about English Premier League football. Yeah. Yeah. Coming now, soon. It's not often we get to react to something that's gone viral that is just down the road. <laughs> it's literally yeah. around the corner. Yeah. I was in Hanforth last weekend. Mm. There's a skate park in Hanforth. Mm. And yeah, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, so <laughs> yeah. skate park. Too old for that. Are you allowed to skate blah. parks? <laughs> yep, yep. That's where that huge bruise on my shin that I showed you, yeah. where the whole thing's black now, that's from there. Nice. Well, you know. I had to put sunglasses on <laughs> to get rid of the whiteness first. Uh, yeah, so this is literally, for people that don't know, this is down the road from us. This is like, how far would you say? Three miles? A few miles. If that. Yeah, it's not far, is it's it? It's a few miles, really? isn't it? But uh, yeah, not far. Uh, yeah, and I haven't watched this. All I've heard is on Radio 1 the other day, they played about a three-second yeah, clip. Yeah, that's what I've heard, just some clips, something. yeah. And it sounds hilarious. Well, I saw it on the news. Oh, did you? Yeah, yeah, I, saw it, yeah, yeah. yeah. I did. But so it's, it's, it's the parish council, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So Hanforth parish council going mad. Um, Zoom meeting. It's gone crazy though, hasn't it? Like this is, I'm seeing people sharing it. I've purposely not watched it for yeah. this reason so <laughs> we can do it. But uh, yeah, I think we get into it. So uh, yeah, why not? Hanforth, Hanforth parish council meeting goes viral after a massive Zoom row. <laughs> Sounds Let's go. great already. Yeah. Yeah. We'll, start the, we'll start the meeting and I want to repeat what I said at the beginning of the last meeting. That this meeting has not been called according to the law. The law no, has been broken. The meeting has been properly Will called. you please let the chairman please, 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 please. If you disrupt this meeting, I will have to remove you from it. You can't. Sure. It's only the chairman who can remove people from a meeting. Do you know what? I've just got to jump in here, right? <laughs> Hanforth is one of them places where people who live there think there's something special really i think so i think it's a bit rough <laughs> that's what i'm saying but it's it's classified because it's just i think what you have you have hill green you have withinshaw yeah and then people manage to move out of withinshaw so they move yeah. to hill green oh yeah and then they get a bit more money and they move out of hill green into handforth <laughs> and then eventually they make more money in handforth than they move to wilmslow <laughs> it's a right? complete different world you grew up in than i grew up in Put it that way, you grew what? up in Woodenshaw and everyone's aspiring to be in Hanford. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, growing up in Altrincham thinking, I fucking hope I don't end up in Woodenshaw <laughs> or Hanford. <laughs> yeah, it's tables and it? it's relegation and promotion. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? But that's that's the, that's the way they got, and they just and this is just Hanford all over for me. Right, right. You know, it's the people. Yeah. Uh, you know what it is? These, these sort of parish councils as well, it's usually people of a certain age where they're it not working is. anymore. Nothing and better to do, sort so of thing. Yeah, it becomes their focus. It becomes yeah. a thing, doesn't it? So yeah. you can see why people are getting into it. <laughs> why would you even be a member of that parish council anyway? Do you nothing? I don't know. I don't know. It's only the chairman who can remove people from a meeting. You have no authority here, Jackie Weaver. No authority at all. She's just kicked him out. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's kicked him out. Don't, don't. She's kicked him out. Don't. This is a meeting called by two councillors. Illegally. They now <laughs> elect a chairman. No, they can't because the vice chair's here. I take charge. Uh, Read the standing orders. Read them and understand them. <laughs> <laughs> Dear me. Um, appalling behaviour. Um, chairman gone. A copy, of this, a copy of this will, in fact, be sent to the monitor officer. Well, well, the well, I hope so. Vice chair. Out of those yeah. people, who where's said, the chairman? Read the orders. It never reverts to me. Where's the chairman gone? Like to elect a chairman for this meeting. You don't have to elect a chairman. There's a chairman already installed. The chairman of the council. 
Councillor Burkle, we've been through this. You don't, what are you talking about? You don't know what you're talking about. My <laughs> <laughs> God, John. <laughs> chairman, the chairman of the council is the is the chairman of the of the. Uh... I vote for John Smith to be chairman of the council. Is he John? Do you know what? If I was that, if I was that woman now, I'd have just gone fuck it, boom, end, yeah. end call, I just, right, see shut you. down, I'm gone. I don't know whose side to be on on this because I feel like the power may have gone to her head and she's just removing all, people. It's gone to all. It's gone to all heads, hasn't it? This is what happens in these kind of environments, isn't it? Yeah, it's just oh, a power, massively. It's a power trip. Isn't the Paris Council just for deciding like what day bin day is and things like that? Is it? I had no idea. I mean, I don't think the massive things are. I mean, but <clears throat> yeah, like I said, I think it's just power mad, aren't they? Some yeah. of them, you know, it is like, what it is. A, like a bit, bit of authority, and they're away, aren't they? It's like That's the co-chair, the co-chairman, or whatever he is, the uh, vice chairman. He's not even got his own computer. <laughs> Harping over someone's shoulder, just, yeah. right? Like a parrot. <laughs> you have no authority. <laughs> I love it. I love it so much. Council. Yeah, I'm going to subpoena everybody. Uh, <laughs> Bert, you know, could I ask you to be to be respectful to Jackie Weaver, Sorry. please? Here <laughs> 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 comes the subpoena. <laughs> Chairman? Oh, leave. Just, you go and start with her. She's kicked Barry out, so I'm leaving. No, no Barry. Stay. No, Barry has gone. Shh. Stay. Oh, Stay. Oh, Stay. Oh, Stay. Oh, Stay. Oh, Stay. Oh, Stay. We're trying to have a team's meeting, you fool. We're trying to have a team's meeting, you fool. We can't if you've got that. We just don't. <laughs> <laughs> Jackie Weaver, I find that uh, the person on Alec Brewerton's uh, Zoom is being very disrespectful to everybody. Oh, coming from you, from Birkenhead, that sounds good. <laughs> my, my, my first point is to apologise to Jackie, but welcome to Handforth. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. So is he having a dig at one of them for being in Birkenhead, but being on uh, the... Uh, the Hanforth it Parish like Council, it, doesn't it? Yeah, sounds about right. Yeah, <laughs> it's just like it's so. proper yokel. It's great stuff. Isn't it? I love stuff like that. Absolutely, <laughs> like even going on about absolute nonsense. I might, yeah. I mean, imagine being sat in that meeting. It'd probably be okay if they were all sat around a the table. They'd probably be able to knock it all out yeah. And, yeah. and get it all done. But in a Zoom meeting, especially when older people get involved in technology, technology or right, it can be a recipe. Yeah. yeah. I mean, how many times even now I watch. I watch like Boris's press conference at, in, in the evening or whatever. How many times is like the older journalist who should know? You're on mute, mate. Yeah, like that. And he's going, yeah, and I'm like, oh, you have... <laughs> you're on national television. Just, you should just cut them off and go, you know what, you've had your chance. <laughs> right? I think yeah. you're right. Anyway, welcome to Anfor. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I love that. That was funny, that. Yeah. That was funny, that. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I love stuff like that. But there's always uh, anywhere with a committee or anything like that like you know the, the club that I drink at has got a committee and you've got to sit before the yeah, committee yeah. before you can become a member mm. it's all the same politics no yeah. matter where it is a parish council committee whatever I mean a lot of it's probably historical and they're probably there to do a job aren't they you know I don't think it's anything that serious what they do maybe I don't know could be, I don't know I what could they be do. proved wrong but no I don't really so I'm just guessing but, so there's uh, no need for them <laughs> well <laughs> us they, three don't know what they do yeah they, they, true they probably do something in smaller communities i'd imagine like i know the parish council where my other house is <laughs> yeah. yeah we don't talk about that that that's a very that's a very small place and the parish councillor actually lives opposite and there's that sort of yokely stuff going on yeah, as well yeah, yeah, you so live in the farmlands or well, I, don't know where my, I don't actually live there so <laughs> my, my par, i guess my parish council would be senator of manchester or something yeah, yeah. yeah that's what yeah. i mean yeah. whereas like i think the the more Villages where there might be like three, four hundred people. I think they probably have more of an impact. That's the mm. point I'm making. But yeah. Hanforth is big. It's not yeah, a small place. Big. Is yeah, it? decent it's size area, isn't it? Yeah. But uh, mm. yeah, that would just wind me up being on that call. Or I just how they lasted it, yeah. so long. I'd just end. I would have been John Smith in that. I would yeah. have just been laughing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, that really amuses me when people act like that. Now it doesn't wind me up whatsoever. I enjoy it. Yeah. I really enjoy yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah, I couldn't imagine it's, being on that call. Uh, well, wouldn't it's have been funny, that five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys like that little bit of a uh, local culture to, uh, yeah, to the office right blokes up. there around the corner. Yeah, and you get a feeling for what people we have to deal with on a day to day basis. Anyway, don't forget like and subscribe, and we'll join you on the next one. Cheers. Thanks, guys. Cheers.